was Gucci. I did it again, bruh. So man, doing so many things and being like a YouTuber and like, you know, grabbing the camera, trying to film for you guys. I don't even know how to explain it, bro. <laughs> I would say like stressful, but it's just like your mind is just always like all over the place. Let's try this game. Got a little tire shop in this bitch. <laughs> it's your boy, back with another video. Day in the life with kicks. Nothing crazy, man, just my life. Hope you guys are all doing well. I'm doing fantastic, man. We got another beautiful day. The weather's great. Man, nothing too crazy today. I'm gonna go pick up the Drift Z and I'm gonna take it to my boy's stereo shop. Uh, that thing desperately needs like upgraded speakers and at least an in-dash so I can have Bluetooth. That shit has stock door speakers and stock stereo. And uh, that's not the business. <laughs> Especially with that loud ass fuel pump, bro. I can't hear nothing. So your boy needs some tunes in there for when I am driving it around. Um, so that's what's going down today. When I'm done, I'm gonna be taking it back to the society headquarters and uh, we're gonna be putting the harness bar in and the belts and uh, possibly maybe the hydro. I don't know. Um, I might just save that for when I do the rest of the suspension stuff. Shit, Dunkin' Donuts. About the rear, my boys like get some donuts. Not gonna be too much of a crazy day, it's just a few little things going on. But you know, you guys are like family now, so I gotta bring you guys with me. All right, real quick, let me show you guys my Hydro. Uh, I went with the Nameless. I heard good things about it. I felt it in the homie's car. It felt pretty good, so I caught. Uh, let's see. Uh -huh. Ooh. Low key though, I feel like I should have got the 18 inch one. Um, I feel like the 13 inch one, I don't know. I don't know, I really don't know. Uh, for reference. I guess it really just comes down to seat position and everything and feel, personal preference. Um, I think this will be fine though. It should be all right. But um, yeah, we're with the nameless one. I said for good things about it, the boy has it in his whip. I was like, okay, cool. I actually ended up ordering the wrong reservoir thing. I needed to get the pass through one. And um, I'm actually going to just order the longer one because we put it in here and the bracket's going to be about right here and low key it sat about like right here so I feel like that's way too short. Um, honestly in my opinion it would be a lot easier if it was here versus like going down here it's like I'm fucking shifting I might as well just shift. So uh, I'm just going to order the other one. It's cool! Well let's go take this piece of shit out. First time driving on the seats. Only thing I would say with these seats, like they recommended me, uh, I don't know why this part right here is like so pushed up, like there's so much padding. Um, I have to take, I'm gonna probably cut the foam in half and have it like reupholstered, that way it sits lower. I mean this side I don't care, but at least for mine, because it fucking makes my legs like, I feel like I'm in a damn car seat. <laughs> Alright guys, we all finished up here. Ooh, it's kind of busting right now. Shout out to my guys over here at Stereo City out here in Ontario. If you need some stereo audio needs, holla at him, man. Don't be shy, be fly. <laughs> These are my guys, man. Day ones, bro. I've never been to another stereo shop. I think like the first time with my G35, I went to some other shop, but after that, as soon as I knew my boy Hernan over here, never went anywhere else. Oh, yup. Um, I didn't do any sub or nothing like that. It's not necessary. Like, I'm not gonna be driving this car like crazy. I just really needed decent speakers in here because I do like music and I need something to overpower that damn fuel pump because all I hear is ee! Oh, and I don't know if you guys noticed, my boy hooked it up with some LEDs. Needed that, so now you can see the interior now. Um, we were going to do the harness bar and the belts today, but the car was here for the majority of the day. Uh, so I'm going to take the car back to them tomorrow and we're going to install that stuff. Finally, your boy got some tunes in here. Got a little end dash. Let you guys see real quick. I didn't like, I didn't cash out on a like crazy one. Honestly, I was just like, look, bro, I just need something with Bluetooth. It doesn't have to be anything crazy. <laughs> I normally get nicer in dashes, but I just wanted something cheap. I just need Bluetooth. It's actually cool because this, uh, I can play YouTube on it, which is pretty cool. We just gotta plug it in. So that's pretty lit. How's everybody doing? And I was on my Mac Miller vibes. But, uh, yeah, man. That's about that. <laughs> Don't wanna hear that shit. Well, I'm about to turn this music on because I'm not trying to hear that shit. <laughs>
Day two. All right, guys, we're just pulling up. We back. Day two. Hola, compa. Another beautiful day. It's always nice to wake up to cars. I don't know about you guys, but it's like so satisfying. <laughs> This thing's so clean. Fresh paint. Look at that, he ain't even got the plastics off the buckets. The rear brides too. This thing, man. Damn, it's so sick. This shit's clean too. Love me some Nissans. Yeah, this thing's been breaking necks on the freeway. Right, guys we got the harness belts over here i wasn't gonna get the green ones but um uh the only ones i had in stock were the clip-on ones and i didn't want those so it's all good as long as it keeps me in there dog so do the work here looking clean harnesses are in and once i have the red hydro in here it's gonna be the icing on the cake Yep, uh, all we're waiting on now is um, our SPL stuff to come in. Gonna get this camber out of the back. Add a little camber up front. Take a little out of the back. And this thing's ready. Certified. I don't have to do anything besides just break shit at that point. Still gotta take off the interior panels and uh, get those repainted. Well, that's about it, man. The interior looks clean. It's not, not like too much going on, you know? Just enough. Day three. What is happening with you guys? We're hopping right into this video from the Drift Z. Um, as you can see, I got a bunch of stuff torn out of here. I uh, just took everything apart. Um, I'm gonna be getting all those panels repainted uh, because this ain't it. I, I just can't, bro. Like, I can't do this. Honestly, I would just do this shit myself, but I don't feel like sanding it down and reheating it. So I'm just gonna have my boy do this. Um, so let me take apart one of them. Gonna get it redone so that way the interior is all OEM looking fresh. And uh, yeah, man, interior wise, we're pretty much done with this. Just want the interior to be clean. And that's it. Um, we got the we got the hydro that's gonna be going in soon, so we're gonna have to be doing some cutting, trimming on some of the plastics. But um, hopefully, it comes out all clean. And yeah, man, we got the SPL stuff on the way. Uh, coils are gonna be going on next week. And this thing will be ready to go. I got my Acubonos in too. Uh, shout out to my guy, Sac City. Got my Acubonos in. I'm waiting on my brackets from Z1 so I can slap those on. We're gonna have some Acubonos in the front. Um, I'm probably just gonna leave them silver. I don't really have any color I wanna do them. I'm not gonna do them obviously red or yellow or anything. It's just gonna look off. So there's already like so much red going on. So I'm probably just gonna leave them silver. Maybe I'll just get like red stickers or something. Um, but yeah, man, she's gonna be pretty much ready to go. I'll um, be getting different tires for the rears too because I can already tell that these uh, these are too sticky for NA. I'm not boosted. If I was boosted, like spin these shits all day, but it's possible to like slide on these, but I can tell they're super grippy because I clutch kicked already a couple times and that shit looky grip. So <laughs> that's not a good thing. We need wheel spin. I'm definitely going to be swapping these out and getting some cheaper tires, uh, probably like the Celeras. And they're definitely uh, good for sliding. So, um, and yeah, they're cheap. That's the most important thing. But yeah, man, uh, I got my headlights off. Uh, I sent those off to uh, my boy. He's gonna redo them, clear them up, and then uh, black out the housing for me. And this thing's like done, pretty much. <laughs>